Unit 8. Listening. Part 1. Exam task. You will hear people talking in eight different situations. For questions 1 to 8, choose the best answer A, B or C. Question 1. You hear a brother and sister talking. Hey, sis, I've lost everything I wrote yesterday and I've no idea why. Fortunately, I backed it up on my memory stick, so I won't have to start again. Have you had any trouble with the laptop today? Well, I know it's getting old, but it hasn't crashed on me or anything. I've been using it this morning and it seems OK. Hang on, is your project called Magnetism? Yeah. Well, it's here, look, in my documents. You must have forgotten to switch user. OK. The internet's slow, though. I lost the connection once. I don't think broadband is very fast here in the village. Question 2. You hear a sports programme on the radio. And with another of the season's big races coming up tomorrow, conditions could be interesting. Temperatures are set to fall rapidly overnight, with some mist forming. That may not clear completely by the time the race starts, and that will mean some frost, so the track could be slippery. There were a few incidents during the last race today, with cars skidding and bumping into each other, so let's hope we don't get a repeat. Things will improve the day after, when sunny intervals and showers are predicted, so it will mean muddy conditions on the rugby field again at the weekend. Question 3. You hear a teacher talking to his class. Well, I'm glad you've sorted out that little problem of leaving litter on the sports field. And just in time, because we're holding a major hockey competition here on Saturday for all the schools in the area. We'd appreciate some help with that. We need about 20 volunteers, some in the car park to show where parents can drop players off, some indoors, making sure everyone knows where the changing rooms are, and a few more to assist with refreshments halfway through the competition. I'll pass a list round, put a tick against your name if you're willing to help. Question 4. You hear a boy and girl talking about school. You know I've always hated maths, Lucy, but I've done much better since we've had that new teacher. He makes it all seem logical. Mm, for me, maths is relaxing. It's all there on the page. I don't enjoy the classes with the new teacher, though. Although he is really good at explaining, he goes too far and makes it all a bit too simple. I'm not being pushed hard at all. You know, asked to do really difficult things in algebra and geometry and so on. Well, yeah. If the class is right for me, it's not going to be right for you, is it? <laughs> I don't know about that. Question 5. You hear a boy talking to his sister about a shopping trip. How was the shopping trip then? The new computer store is great. You can't get near any of the PlayStations and stuff because there are so many people, but they sell some great games. Where else did you go? That fast food place. I lost Joe and Mike on the way there. I thought they were just playing a trick on me when they didn't reply to my texts, so I hid behind one of the little trees outside the fast food place and gave them a real shock when they walked past. I wish I hadn't done it now. They were upset because they couldn't find me. Oh, are you still speaking? Just about.